So, can you see my nipples through this shirt? I know, I know, it's a pretty awkward question. But it's not like I'm the first person to wonder this. I mean, it was in an episode of Friends. Can you see my nipples through this shirt? <laughs> see, Chandler Bing and I have the same concerns. So why am I so concerned about this? Well, it goes back to something that happened at an old job. I was working at a TV show, and one day I wore a white t-shirt very similar to this one. Then when the showrunner came into the writer's room, he looked at me and was like, Wait, is that your actual shirt? To which I said, Yeah. Why? Why? Look at you, I can see your nipples! And from here, it became a bit of a thing. It was kind of like an inside joke between all the writers. But it was more than just a joke. Artwork was created. That's right, my nipples inspired artwork. See, one of the cameramen on the show was also a whiz with Photoshop. And since my nipples were such a topic of discussion, they asked him to Photoshop my face onto that famous shirtless picture of Jim Morrison. And needless to say, he ran with this task and created this gem of a Photoshop creation. I actually still have my copy of it here. The other copy, well, that was hung up in the writer's room for the rest of the season. Which kind of tells you all you need to know about what kind of workplace a TV writer's room is. It's the kind of place where an employee's nipples can become the basis for wall decorations. But the point of all this is that I'm kind of self-conscious about wearing white t-shirts now, because this happened six years ago and I haven't worn them since, but I think it's time to get back on the horse, which is how we arrive at the title of this video. Now don't get nervous, I'm not going to ask you to actually look and tell me if you can see my nipples, I'm not a monster. No, I'll do that myself, because this is a new shirt and I actually haven't taken a good look at myself in the mirror with it yet, I've been saving it just for this video. Think of it like Groundhog's Day and Punks of Tony Phil, but instead of looking for a shadow to see if there'll be six more weeks of winter, I'm looking for a nipple to see if there'll be six more years of no white t-shirts. Hmm, I don't know. Pretty sure I see a nipple there. <laughs> oh, I'm really running out of video ideas during quarantine. 